Dad, four to one. Mum, four to one. Kid, Evans' favourite. It's Dad! Oh! oh. Paddy Power Bookmaker. Let's make things more interesting. Oh. But before we begin the tournament, let's review how the game is played. Texas Hold'em is a variation of poker, but what it shares with all poker games is that the winning hand will be the highest ranked five card poker hand according to the official ranking of poker hands. High card, then one pair. Two pair is higher still, then three of a kind. A straight is five in a row, any suit. Flush is five of the same suit in any order. A full house is three of one kind, two of another. Four of a kind is what it says, and a straight flush is five in a row, all of the same suit. A royal flush is a straight flush, ace high. And we have Evelyn here with us. Evelyn, you've never played before, have you? That's true, Jesse. I've never played poker, so I need to know where to start. The first thing that happens is the placing of the button and the posting of the blinds. So what's a button? This is the dealer button. It signifies who the nominal dealer is. The blinds are compulsory bets placed to the left of the button that get the action going. So to get the action going, I need to place a blind? Yeah, you need to put out one unit, and that's the small blind. And I need to put out two units, which is the big blind. Blinds are posted. Let's deal the cards. These are our personal cards. Action is on me. I have three options. I can call, which would be to match the bet and continue in the hand. I could fold, throw away my cards, surrender my claims on the pot, but not lose any more money. Or I could raise, increase the bet, and other players would have to match this am amount if they want to continue in the hand. I'm going to just call. Well, I'm happy with my cards, so I'm going to call. And I just call. Okay, sweep the chips. The betting round is done. Let's see the flop. Now, what's the flop? Well, these three cards are community cards, which means we can use them along with our personal cards in building the best five-card poker hand. Now, the flop is down. Action to the left of the button. Evelyn, that's you. So what are my options now? Well, you can check or bet. Okay. To okay. check would mean you decline the option to bet, but don't want to fold your hand just yet. I think I'll check. I'll bet. Two. Bet is two. I call that bet. Evelyn, back to you. You can call, raise, or fold. So I have to match your bet. If you want to continue, that's correct. I'll continue. OK, the betting round is done. Bets are even. Sweep the chips. Let's see the turn card or the fourth card, another community card, action to the left of the button. And what are my options now? Check or bet. I think I'll check. I'll check. Checking is not for grown-ups. Bet, and let's bet four. OK, I think I'll fold at this point. OK, you surrender your claims to the pot. You can't win the hand. Liam, four to you. I'll right, call. Bets are even. Sweep the chips. Let's see the last card or the river card. No more cards to come. We must now make the best five-card poker hand out of seven available. But there's one last betting round. Action to the left of the button. I'll right, bet. Four. I raise, see your four, and five more. I'll call. OK, time for a showdown. Best hand wins the pot. Pair of aces, and Liam, you're going to scoop this one. I'll win the pot. That's holding poker. Place the button and post the blinds for the first hand of the Paddy Power Poker Tournament. 23 players here. We're playing down to one. I'm here with the gentleman, Liam Flood. And Liam, this is anybody's poker tournament. This is definitely anybody's poker tournament because it's made up of uh, small players who play in the jackpot club in Dublin every Wednesday and Friday night and the tournaments are £15 entry fee on a Wednesday and £20 on a Friday. It's big money for them to put in £400. So these are the brightest and best of the up-and-coming Irish poker players? Yes, Jesse, and these are the table positions for the first week. 
They were looking at Sean Tobin. Sean has won a few tournaments recently in the club. Um, he was away for maybe 12 months or something like that, but he's playing particularly well at the moment. Well, we're underway here for the first hand. Action will be on Sean first. The blinds are 25 and 50, and he's flat called the 50 bet. And so has Brian Dowling. And now Michael Frisbee has put in a raise. It looks like he's doubled the size of the yeah, bet. Yeah, he's made it 100. It's 100 straight. Oh. And there you can see what he's done it on. Pretty good hand, Liam. Yep. And Sean Tobin has called him. The action is complete for the pre-flop betting round. That's the flop. Those three cards are community cards. And you can see Sean has matched up a nine in his hand with a nine on the board. But Liam, that's not higher than two queens yet, is it? No. Uh, Michael Bett and uh, Sean threw his cards in. So uh, Michael Frisbee is the chip leader. So the first pot over without a showdown, but Sean Tobin made a correct decision to fold Liam. He was well outgunned by two queens. My name is Michael Frisbee. Uh, I'm a performance driving instructor. What that means is I teach people how to drive on racetracks, how to drive high performance cars. This is a seven card game. There were still two cards to come. Sean got out of that pot before the hand was over. He didn't want to risk any more money, did he? No, in actual fact, if he put in any more money, he was ris probably risking his 4,000 uh, because the next bet would, was probably five, 500. And, um, Okay, new hand, new cards for everyone. The blinds and the button are set, and the action will be... On Brian Dowling. He decided to fold, won't cost him anything. Stephen has folded, Michael has folded. It's around to Eileen on the button. And Eileen has called. It's a flat call. The blinds are in and will be three-way action for the pot. And there's 150 pound in the pot at the moment. That's the flop. It comes queen high. Check. Check. Small blind to act first. It was checked around, Liam. No yep. one wanted to wager. That's a free card, and now a new betting round will commence. There's been a bet Roy. out of the small blind. That Roy. was Roy. Roy bet, and uh, Eileen called. Sean would wait. Roy, using his 10 in his hand, has queens and 10s. Roy uh, put a lot of money in there, Liam, on the river, and he was, un he was not called. He won the pot. <laughs> Roy played his hand very well. He checked on the flop, and when the queen came up on 4th Street to make him two pair, he decided that Eileen did not have a queen, so he betted and won the pot. Roy Brindley, 30-something, forget, my memory's not good. Um, occupation, uh, magazine editor and odds compiler and uh, anything involving greyhound racing.